Hey, what's up, One Harbor? Donnie here. I want to talk to you quickly about just some of the changes uh, with, that we're going to make regarding how we watch sermons online. The big news is that we're going to take down the live stream for the time being. Um, you know, we've been thankful for technology. Over the last 13 months, it's allowed us to, to keep holding out Jesus to each other and worshiping together and praying together. If we went five months, we couldn't even gather in person. I don't know what we would have done without that technology. And then around July last year, if you remember, we were able to start regathering, but um, with lots of measures in place. And, and so many people felt like, gosh, it just wasn't the right time for them to come back. They felt, you know, health concerns. Um, and and so, so we jumped in and figured out live stream. Some volunteers have just worked tirelessly on that. It's been a tremendous strain for them, but, but they've done so joyfully because we really saw the necessity of it. Now, uh, since then, a lot of those live stream kind of what numbers, people watching has, has dropped off dramatically. And, and, you know, what's increased dramatically has been the amount of people back physically in the room at our sites, which we're thankful for. I mean, I, I think all of us w would agree that we're, we're glad that the technology was there, but it's nothing like being together in person, you know. Um, and so we are still, um, you know, fighting for, for, you know, gathering in safe ways on Sunday mornings. In fact, all of our sites, um, you know, uh, now as we start to work through lifting these restrictions right now, we will still have a socially distant section at every location for folks. We're all still wearing masks right now. I'm sure that'll drop off eventually, but you know, we're, we're still, you know, doing as many things as we can to make those Sunday mornings safe. Um, but man, we, we're not seeing the, the amount of people watching the live stream that I think deems it necessary. Um, you know, when we look at the, the strain it is on, on our volunteer teams, which have, have all, have all been, um, you know, um, have, have become much smaller over this last season. Um, and so it's fewer people doing a, a lot more work. And so we want to jump in and, and help relieve them. Um, if you still feel like you need to watch the sermon from home and we get that, um, and those sermons will be available to, to you at the latest online by, by Monday morning. Um, sometimes it's even sooner than that. So um, that, that would be a way for you to still watch from home. And if that is you, if you feel like you just can't come back physically yet, uh, gosh, would you reach out to us? Because we want to know how, how are we doing as a church, loving you and serving you? Is there anything we can do for you? We don't want you to feel like you're isolated and alone. We want to find ways to support you and care for you. Um, but thanks for understanding. Um, you know, these changes can always be difficult, but you know, we really feel like it's the right decision for now. And uh, we love you guys. God bless you. Have a great week.